yo 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 what's going on kids how you guys doing it's your boy polite so today guys we're going to be talking about how to set up and use Kovax to better your fortnite aim first things first guys don't forget to subscribe and turn on those notification bells so you don't miss another one of these videos all right let's get into it now real quick just as a disclaimer this video is not for controller players i'm sorry to you controller players watching this right now this is only for keyboard and mouse players all right let's get back into the video all right guys so we're gonna start off by opening kovacs fps aim trainer it is on steam for ten dollars if you guys don't have it then you're gonna go ahead and wait for all the workshop scenarios to load up all right now we're gonna press escape go to the game options if you go to the video tab on the left you'll see a resolution section you'll go to this drop down menu select whatever resolution your fortnite is so mine's is 1920 by 1080 so i'm going to keep that if you do have a custom one custom resolution you can go to custom and edit that resolution here otherwise stay to the native resolution and then we're going to go to the weapons tab and make sure this box is checked. It is so that you can hide the weapon in Kovax. That way it doesn't uh, distract you in any way. And then we're gonna come over to this first drop down menu where you're gonna select Fortnite slider. And right below that, you're gonna put in your main Fortnite sensitivity, which would be either your X or your Y sensitivity, which should be the same if you're on mouse and keyboard. So put that in right here and since vertical sensitivity locked to horizontal is checked this will apply for both x and y in kovacs so you'll be fine there now this is where it can get a little bit complicated if you're going to practice hip fire aim then you're going to want to change the fov measurement and fov slider now for fov measurement if you're going to do hip fire aim for fortnite this is specifically for fortnite you're going to change your fov measurement to overwatch and you're gonna change your FOV to 103. Now, Aimer7 said that this is the most accurate perspective that you can get for Fortnite, since Fortnite is a third person shooter and technically Kovacs is a first person aim trainer. And then if you do wanna do ADS sensitivity, you'll have to go to your targeting sensitivity in Fortnite, see what that is, multiply that number by your main hipfire sensitivity and then you will get your actual ads sensitivity that you can then put into this horizontal sensitivity box right here also you will have to change the fov measurement and fov again so that it matches the perspective of your ads in fortnite so you'll have to change fov measurement to clamped horizontal and your fov to 80 and for your ADS sensitivity, it would look like this. And what this would look like for your hip fire sensitivity would be this. Yo, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like. If you guys have any questions, comment below. And if you haven't already, make sure to follow me on Mixer. I just switched over there not too long ago. But other than that, guys, it's been your boy Polite. And I'm out. Peace.